Hi guys, welcome to today's video. We're here with Efrit, who is our Hi. friend, and we are going to be taste testing some Oreos. Right now, Oreo is doing a competition that's kind of like how Lay's has done in the past, where they have the customers like try to suggest new flavors, and they have three of them that they want us to vote on, and we're gonna decide which one should stick around. So we also have some that are like strange flavors that we didn't realize that they had, and we're gonna try those too. And yeah, so what flavors do we have, Jason? We have kettle corn, pina colada, and what excites me the most, cherry cola. Those are the ones that are for the competition. The other ones are ones that they've already had that we're just gonna try. The Efren and I didn't know existed. <laughs> I had no idea that cinnamon bun and lemon, well I guess lemon and cinnamon bun, I had no idea that those were a thing. I'm really excited to see how they're like. And then of course we have the classic, my favorite, the regular classic Oreos. My favorite Oreo, which we didn't get, is the Thins that are the mint. Oh gosh. Oh no, those, those are delicious. So those are my favorite Oreo. I do like the classic though. I think everyone has to appreciate the classic. So you can't have an Oreo without its sidekick. In my case, that's milk, but not forever. See, okay, so we were walking through, we were at the store and we were walking through the wine section and I was like, huh. I wonder if there's a good like wine pairing for Oreos. And then I looked it up and the website suggested a whole bunch of wines that I've never heard of and could not pronounce. And then it said stout. So I was like, okay, I'll just get a stout beer. So um, I got a stout and uh, we're gonna see how well it goes with Oreo cookies. It's not just a stout though, it's no, an espresso. It's, it's a milk espresso, espresso milk stout. So I guess it should go good because it's like milky coffee EE. It's the split shot like... Elysium. Elysium, that's how you say that? Yeah. So I'm going to also try that if he is so kind to share. And so I have my milk lactose free because white girl problems. I got Powerade. So. I, have I don't have a good reason. We're going to be double fisting for this Oreo taste test. Oreo years. We'll remind ourselves what the original Oreo tastes like. Oh, okay, ready? Dink it. Cheers. No, that's not worth it. Sorry, I love Rhett and Link. Huh? Rhett and Link. They always say dink it right before they... Dink it and sink it. Mmm. Mm. Delicious. Class Ooh! Let's see how this tastes. Wow, actually that is really good. That blows my mind how good that is. I mean, let's try kettle corn first. Ooh, ooh. I don't know how I feel so, about that. That's gonna be weird. We'll find out. They kind of did like I feel like it's a, just gonna taste buttery. Mm. So they did like a, they tried to do like different styles of each of these Oreos. So like the pina colada is the thins the mm. cola is like the original kind, and then this is like the blonde Oreo, the kettle corn. And so, oh, no, this one. no, it's not a thing, just the. So, it says that it has puffed millet pieces, millet. so it's supposed to be crunchy. Huh. So, it reminds me of something, but not kettle corn. Reminds me of the one with the frog. Crave? No, no, I know what you're talking no, no, about. The the one, it looked like little kernels. Yeah, they look little kernels. I'll have to look it up. It's very mapley. Yeah, that's that's what. I mean, it it's reminds kind of me of um, maybe it's French toast crunch. It might Ooh. be. So it has like a. I will return. I need to get more water. All right. So we determined it smells like. It does kind of smell like kettle corn, though. It kind of, but it yeah, kind like of. maple. You said hazelnut. It's oh, definitely. Oh no, hazelnut cream candle or French toast crunch. Yeah. So I'm going with strong. kettle corn and maple leaf. Alright, so All right. I'm gonna eat it how I eat a regular Oreo. Cheers. 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 So you have to pull out your Oreo at the exact perfect time because you don't want it too soft, but I you do. also the science don't of want it too like crunchy. You know? It blows my mind how it does taste like kettle corn. These are great. <laughs> I don't like them. No? No. I'm a fan. I did not think I would be because I'm not a fan of kettle corn. 
I don't think it tastes like kettle, kettle corn. I know, that's why I like it. I think it tastes like kettle corn. It tastes like French Toast Crunch, which I love. It tastes like... It doesn't pair as well. I can imagine. Mm-mm. Because there's like no it. chocolate to it. Mm-hmm. All right, well. Au revoir. Pina colada thin. I'm excited. All of them at once. All right. I'm ready to dig it. It might be. No, it's not pretty purple. So, okay. So, we've determined these smell like a cereal, but I can't place the name of the Buy cereal. Buy them. Smell them. Tell and us let what you me say know, in the comments. Yeah. Let me know if you can remember what cereal. It's very specific. Tell us what you say. Tell us what you smell. Oh. Tell us what you smell. <laughs> All right. Ready? Yep. Cheers. Cheers. Now, these ones you don't have to dunk as long. They're thin. I'll dunk them just as long. Mmm. I'm not the biggest fan of piña colada, but it's a good cookie. It's not bad. It doesn't really taste like anything. It almost tastes like bubble gum to me. Yes, it does. Like bubble gum, but also like a buttered popcorn jelly bean. I get the buttered popcorn taste. Mm -hmm. Weird. I don't Why did that not come from my like kettle corn? I didn't get that from the kettle. That, I got it from the stove. That's what I'm saying. Actually, it doesn't pair like very well, but it brings out the flavor in the beer. Yeah, it was. Like you make this, it, 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 this you actually taste like the coffee with that mm -hmm. cookie. Well, what they already have with the uh, Oreo thins is they have a coconut one, and it's actually a chocolate instead of a blonde Oreo. So I've gotten those before. Those are really good, and this I feel like was kind of like similar. But they aren't, the taste is completely different. Like, it doesn't taste like a piña colada to me. Piña colada. But it's not bad. I didn't, I did not like the kettle corn one. I, I forgot it. that piña mm -hmm. colada was a pineapple and coconut. That's why it smelled fruity. Our next one is the cherry cola Oreo. Ooh. And these ones in the middle have a popping candy. What? Oh, what? Ain't nobody told me that. Ooh, I'm kind of, I'm excited for the popping, but at the same time, still the too. I've had Oreos that pop. So it's gonna be straight up like a soda. Yes, it's gonna, that's, it's gonna well, fizz like a soda. I can smell it, yeah. It looks like the cinnamon ones, like during Christmas time. It the smells cinnamon. like, okay, if you, the Lush had. Oh my God. <laughs> I know where you're going with it and you're 100% correct. That's exactly yes. what it smells like. Okay, what? so Lush had, what was the name of that? Uh, Santa's Creation or something. There was a Lush. Santa's something. Yeah, there's a I Lush, like Lush. So, that was like cola scented. And it has like that like fake, yeah. All right, we ready? Yes. All right, here we go. I just want to scrape it. the stuff out of the middle and eat it. Well, you could eat, some people eat Oreos that way. I do, I'm just not doing it that way for the video. Why? You should eat it. There are plenty of people out there who take their Oreos apart. I just... Oh, it has like rock candy in it. Oh, it's Pop Rock. Pop yeah, rocks. that's what I meant, Pop oh, Rocks. Oh gosh, it's falling apart. I don't know, I soaked it too. I haven't had this happen. Ooh, it's in the back of my throat now. <laughs> um, well the, hey, I'm, I, oh, there it is, there's the pop. I'm a little disappointed, it, oh wait, but cherry coke has a very distinct flavor, right? Mm -hmm. It smells far more, oh wait, I haven't gotten to the cola side, apparently. I don't know if you guys heard that, I heard it. Okay. Well, it's like, yeah, the firework ones that they had for 4th of July last summer were uh, Pop Rocks. Mm-hmm. But I don't think I would buy these to just snack on them the, w the way I would the regular ones. But would you normally buy other flavored Oreos? If you were gonna, yeah. See, so. No. That's unfair. <laughs> that's a trip. I'm a hypocrite. I'm going in for just the cream. That does pair better. I think just in general, the chocolate oh. pairs better. There you go. Well. I like it a lot. I mean, I knew that was going to be your favorite one, though. It smells better than it tastes. And while I do really, really like them, I don't know that it's my favorite. Really? Yeah. Well, we'll leave that. You know, but I think if it didn't have, because the Pop Rocks are still popping, I think if it didn't have the Pop Rocks, I would have liked it a little more. I, I, I really like the Pop Rocks in it. I feel like you're drinking cola. Like it's, I don't know. It's something. Because I normally wouldn't buy... Other flavor, oh no, that's not true. I, like, I would buy the mint ones. I buy the mint ones, I do buy the, I don't buy Oreos a lot though. 
No, it's very rare. I love Oreos, but I don't just, I can't. Like it has to be I like feel good. bad when I eat Oreos, but we it's so good. Have them in our house, no, we so. don't buy them. So yeah, this, we may, it may sound like we buy them a lot. We don't. So What are we going to do with all, what are you guys going to do with all these? I guess for over the next like six months, these are going to be our desserts. Okay. So. Ooh. Cinnamon, cinnamon bun. bun. Well, let's, for the Oreos creation. So for the three that we have to vote oh, on. Oh, oh, we, we we made it through them? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. There three. was only three. So. Out of all of them, which one did I like the most? For me, I think I'd have to say that it goes the kettle corn, the cherry cola, and then the pina colada. It pains me to say it because I love cherry cola in all forms, but I agree. Kettle corn, cherry cola, pina colada. I have a different opinion. I didn't like the kettle corn though, so that's just me. But I, I don't even, I, this surprises me because I don't even like cola, but something about these. What? I think it's because it's the chocolate and the pina colada one, we already have a coconut, I don't know. So I would say cherry cola, then pina colada, and then kettle corn. I would have expected her response to be pina colada, kettle corn, cherry cola. I didn't like the kettle corn ones. So, oh, those are our opinions. Actually, we, you know what, yeah, these and the regular ones, I could get down the next couple. Weeks. So if we had to take a vote to to agree that kettle corn should win. Yeah, ultimately, yeah. but apparently the pina colada is a solid second place. Oh, it's a solid no is what it is. From us, yeah. Oh, that's right, you guys didn't like <laughs> it. No, yeah, no, no. It was the, solid the solid second out. place okay. was the, the soda. The cola, one. yeah. All right, so, so let's try our odds flavors. That are in some apart. cinnamon buns. You got honey bun in your mouth? <laughs> what is that from? That's from a movie. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. It smells like a cinnamon roll. Oh. Just not one that I want to eat. This smells like cinnamon toast crunch. This no, cereal. that smells like a cinnamon roll. It smelled, yeah, I gotta say it. But you know what? The first, like, the top note <laughs> is Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but then you smell like the actual like vanilla and like cinnamon glaze and of, a, of yes. a cinnamon bun. Like you're walking past Cinnabon. Yes. Like yeah. Yes. You know what? I just realized we did this in the perfect order because nothing is a better palate cleanser than lemon. That's true. All right. Me it up. <laughs> Me it up. <laughs> or Oreos. Oh. I'm not excited about that's like this my, <laughs> That's like my catchphrase. What? Meet up. Meet up. I <laughs> yeah, oh, I didn't even, I didn't, I didn't cheers it. I just went for the milk. You just wow. 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 Okay. Right. Cheers. Hold on. Cheers. Let me Absolutely. cheers, guys. No, Let's you're see. sloppy. Ooh. Oh, God. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Solid. This, I want to say, it doesn't really taste like this. Like, it's cinnamony and like, I think it tastes more like cinnamon toast crunch. I do. I love that cereal too. Mm -hmm. So, I do think it tastes like cinnamon toast crunch. It reminds me of cinnamon teddy grams. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. That's exactly what this is. Is a cinnamon. But teddy. with cream. Yeah. With cream. Oh. <laughs> see, it did not pair well. No, that didn't quite. <laughs> I want to see if any of you think say what I think it smells like. Boy. I swear, if you say pine salt. No. It pines all those pine smell. Or There's lemon pledge. Oh, pledge. Oh my gosh. What do you smell like? What are you smelling? I don't remember what that is. <laughs> what? These do not smell like lemon. I mean, there's like a lemon bottom note or hint <laughs> note or like whatever. You know how like there's top notes, mid notes, low notes or whatever it smells. I don't know that, but. I have no idea what that smells like. Let me smell it one more time. No, it just smells like the garbage can after you take it out. Oh my god, that's so true. It is. Oh it no, it, it smells like the scented trash bags. <laughs> oh no. Not even that. To me, it smells. Yeah, kind of like I guess, but like like you know when you take these seem double stuffed. I think all of them do. Except for the original ones. And the thin ones. And the thin ones. All right, dink it. Oh. There it smells like Jason. Originally, I was gonna say lemon pledge, and then I smelled it again and was like, no. Taste it and think Earl Grey. Oh no. Like the first, like, because after you eat it a little bit, it doesn't taste like it, but that first mm -hmm. hit, it tastes like Fruit Loops. Yes. Yep. Oh my god. This is definitely a Fruit, fruit Loops. Loops. 
All right. Well, what about our rankings of all of them now? How would we do it? I mean... Original Oreo comes in first. For me, definitely. Oh, hell no. No? You don't like the original Oreo? Mm -mm. I would give it to either kettle corn or quite honestly, the lemon. The lemon was really good. It was for, good. For me, it tasted way better than this. For me, I would go the original Oreo, um, the kettle corn, the lemon, the cinnamon bun, the cola, and then the pina colada. I wasn't a fan of the cinnamon bun too much. Oh, mm. I like that one a lot. It was good. I it would was. say, honestly, this is gonna, I just have a completely different palette, I guess. The original Oreo would definitely come in first. And then it would be probably the lemon, then the cinnamon bun, then the cola, then the pina colada, and then the kettle corn. And then the kettle corn? I didn't like the kettle corn. She did corn. not like the kettle corn. Oh I've God, said that never. several times. You I can know. get shocked. I know. I'm just baffled by it. Mm -hmm. I think um, I'm, I'm a mess. Look at you oh, guys yeah. and then look at me. All the crumbs. I think if I had to rate it... I would say my top one, I mean, I hate to do this, but I think my yeah, top one choice. is kettle corn, followed by lemon, followed by cherry cola, then, yeah, cinnamon bun, original pina colada. Well. I said I liked Oreos a lot. I do. <laughs> the original ones. There you have it. <clears throat> Our feelings on flavored Oreos. I like them. I like them a lot. I, I do. I was, I was really expecting them to be bad. And they were pretty decent. They were okay. For the most part. Well, there's our opinion on all these flavored Oreos. And we hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give us a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you want to see more and leave us a comment and let us know what was the flavor I wanted to know too. I really want to know about that. Was it? Oh, pina? oh. I think it's the pina colada. We don't remember. You can rewind. And watch again. Please do let us know in the comments. I really want to know if any of you can tell me because it's a very specific cereal for my childhood. Anyway. <laughs> All right. Bye guys. Bye. Bye. Nice meeting y'all.